Please don't look with me. What is up you guys and I am back with another video and I'm going to be looking down because the monitor is actually down here so I can get a better view of what I'm doing or what I'm saying. But this is going to be a, a rant basically of lashing and the stupidest questions I get online. And I'm just going to start off by saying this. If you get offended by this video or you're like damn she's rude as fuck. Ooh she's a bitch. I'm not going to her. Honestly I don't care. <laughs> I'm just keeping it real with you guys by making this video, letting you know how I feel. Just come, it's, it's like they're like common sense stuff, and it just gets to me. And this video is so long overdue because you guys just really don't understand sometimes. So I'm gonna let you know again if you get offended by this video or you feel some type of way. Honestly, you don't have to come to me. I'm just letting you know how I feel and just being real. Sorry, last taking it real with you. But, um, it's gonna be a mukbang. So I got some avocado, some nachos with chicken, and some refried beans on top. There's no specific order as to how, as to what I'm saying, basically. Okay, so the first one I have on my list, I have a little list. <clears throat> the first one on my list is booking fills with no lashes. You guys, you have to be better than this. You know when you need to book your fill. You know how you're supposed to take care of your lashes. You cannot message me and be like, do you think I will have enough lashes for a fill? I don't know. I'm not your lashes. I'm not home with you. I don't know what you're doing at home. I don't know. I'm not, I'm not sitting on your lash. But book your fills with no lashes. You're sitting there on your phone. You know you have no lashes on. And you're just like, mm, yeah, let me look, let me book a fill because that's what I need because I have no lashes. And then you have the nerve to show up here and be like, I know I don't have any lashes on. So you waited until the day of your appointment to tell me you don't have any lashes on? What? Who does that? Why? Why would you show up like that? Or you come in and you lay down. And you're like, I look at them and you're, I'm, I'm like, you don't have any lashes on. And they're, you're like, I know. So you knew when you still booked it with a fill? Huh? You still booked a fill and you have no lashes on? No, honey. You just want the full price. You want the full, the full service. Can I help you? I'm sorry. You can hear me? Go to your room. Anyways, you want the full service for half the price. It doesn't work that way. Because I will sit here and I'll charge you the full price or I'll tell you to leave. Simple. Another one, arriving late. I do have a $10, $15 fee if you show up late. It's not my fault. You get the address 24 hours before your appointment. I do not control traffic. I, do not, I don't control traffic. I don't control the light system. I don't, I don't control anything. I control it how much you're gonna give me if you're late. Um, with that one, arriving late, I do have a grace period. You have 15 minutes that you can be late. After 15 minutes, your appointment's canceled because by then you're making me push back time. You're making me push back to other clients, and it don't work that way. <coughs> so, another one on the list is having dirty lashes. Just having dirty lashes. You guys, clean your freaking lashes. If you are a makeup user, like a heavy makeup user, an eyeshadow user, a mascara user, on the bottom lashes, all that gunk and, and build up gets onto your lashes and it's just disgusting. It's disgusting as fuck. Um. Do you want me to fill? Fill that. And that's just why I, yeah. These lashes is disgusting. Clean your lashes. It's not expensive. I have a lash bath here you can buy. There's other lash baths you can buy if you don't want to buy mine. There you can YouTube it. Just just clean your lashes. Please. It's, it's not a lot, but these these little I, I, making my head hurt right now. 
spots are first come first serve if no deposit is sent then your appointment is cancelled honey actually let me go in and cancel somebody right now because I texted her because she was doing a training I texted her I said hey don't forget to send your deposit and this was this morning I said I texted her hey don't forget to send your deposit bear in mind I don't ever text y'all to let you know to send your deposit I just canceled the appointment so if you don't send a deposit I mean it, you can cancel I'm not gonna hold your spot I don't care if it's ten dollars or fifty dollars two dollars if you don't pay a deposit you don't got no appointment so that with that being said if I post a time online and I say the spot is available and you don't send your deposit and somebody else wants it and I give it to them but I already told you I'm giving it to you and, but you didn't send your deposit that appointment's not yours until you send a deposit okay okay um um this one this one this one right here let me tell you what is online is what's available so for instance an example I see you're booked until so and so but I was wondering if you still have availability if you see that it's booked how would I have availability how if, when you can figure that one out let me know I'm human like I don't sit here and I don't lash all day my back hurts my feet my fingers start hurting my head starts hurting my eyes start hurting I need time off so whatever is online is what I have okay um at the end of the day it ain't personal it's all business okay so do not message me thinking I'm a full time out of my ass or time is just gonna time is just floating in the air and I'm just gonna grab it for you because it don't work that way. If it's not available online, it's not available. I have available I have a scheduling app for a reason. If it's not on if it's not there, it's not there. Okay. Ooh. But yeah, that one right there irks my nerve annoying and the last one on my list is when I when my client comes in I always ask them okay so I know you booked a classic set how do you want them long medium short lengthwise and they'd be like I want them full but not too dramatic, just a little dramatic. You booked the classic set, honey. How are you getting a full look? A classic set can only go as full as your natural lash. Um, where do you want me to put these classics on if you even got no lashes? I don't get it. How does that make sense? I don't know how that makes sense either. But when you figure it out, I, I would love for you to let me know. Just love for you to let me know. Damn. But as of right now, guys, that's all I really have in my, for my list of annoyance with flashing. If there was a lash up, and something else bothered you let me know down in the comments below because honey these clients be tripping and like I said if you take it offensive way or you're like dang she's a bitch dang she's this dang she's that but don't book with me I honestly don't care please don't book with me because then that means you're going to be an annoying client if you feel that type of way and I don't like annoying clients none there are a lot of lash techs around that can take you but I ain't I'm full
for you guys. That wraps up this video. Give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to share. Don't forget to like. Uh, like I said, if you feel some type of way and you feel like this was towards you, maybe it was. Maybe it wasn't. I don't know. You don't know. The world may never know. But don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe to your girl. Oh, and I'll see you in my next video.